Alright, this video was supposed to be a DES guide for GMC Canyons and Chevrolet Colorados with a 2.8 Duramax and it ended up kind of being a troubleshooting guide too so I'll go ahead and upload all the footage I have on my first experience with DEF fluid alright today's video I'm creating a diesel exhaust fluid guide for GMC Canyons and Chevrolet Colorados with the 2.8 liter Duramax I was driving around last night and a DEF warning came on letting me know I have 300 miles left before I have to fill it up fill up the DEF tank I didn't hit dismiss so the warning should still be on the on the little screen here the info screen so let's check it out right now there it is exhaust fluid range 292 miles is it focused? It says 292, so I'm going to go ahead and start this up. So, hit dismiss. And then if we go to the DEF Life, I think it's at, okay, 13. 13%. I did the math already. It was at 14 when I was driving last night, but I did some math. I'll show you guys later. But 13%, uh, 24, 15 miles left. Or 2,415 miles on the on the um, odometer here. We're, I'm going to go ahead and do some calculations, but let's go ahead and uh, pick up some DEF fluid right now. Okay, this is what DEF fluid costs. Super Tech, that's Walmart brand, one gallon, four forty two. Peak, twelve dollars, that's two point five gallons. This truck, the Colorado holds five point five, so two of these would almost fill it up. And then here's a bigger Walmart brand. Right there, uh eight dollars for two gallons, 2.5 gallons of that's, oh, that's motor oil. Okay, so that's it, two brands of DEF. I'll go ahead and pick this up. Okay, if you're new to your truck, you might not see a percentage level on the DEF fluid level screen. It shows percentage when you're at 29%. At 29%, it was warning me that there was a thousand miles left on the DEF tank and that happened at around 1330 miles I'm at 2421 right now so that was more than a thousand miles ago so it was just an estimate on how many miles I had left so that was more than a thousand so it looks like 5.5 gallons is the capacity of this so it looks like the range is anywhere from five to six thousand miles maybe more I'm at a six thousand mile pace I'm kind of a nerd, so I enjoy math, so I did a little math here. It's good for you. It's good for your brain to think that's totally made up. I just made that up right now. It's a good theory, though. So 5.5 gallons is the capacity. 25% would mean that there's 1.375 gallons left, so at 14% I'm at 0.77 gallons. So 1.375 minus 0.71. So if I add 0.605 gallons, I should be at 25%. So this is not a clear bottle, so I'm just going to go by the field test versus the eye test. I'm going to pour in about half of that, and that should get me near 25%. So let's go ahead and try that out right now. On this truck, the DEF is conveniently located next to the fuel fill-up. I like how there's warnings on the DEF jug that says, Do not add to your diesel. 
I wonder how many people actually do that and how many people put diesel in this. All right, let's go ahead and put about half, half of that bottle in here. Okay, I added about half of the container, so my percentage should be in the 20% range somewhere. This might take a couple drive cycles, so let's see if it updated right away or if I'm going to have to drive this a few times before I get an accurate reading. Oh, it says okay. Oh, but then now it says uh, exhaust fluid range 287. Okay. Now it says 13%. All right. Let's drive it around a little bit and see what happens. Uh, it might take a couple drive cycles. Okay, I'll just keep the camera handy, see what happens. Okay, I've driven this around 60 miles through several drive cycles since I added the half gallon of DEF fluid and the computer hasn't updated the DEF level yet. Turn the key. It's gonna say okay. There it is. There's the uh, heads up. Exhaust fluid range 240 miles. Hit dismiss. It's at 13 percent. So I first saw the warning when it was 29 percent and it told me that I have about a thousand miles of DEF fluid left and then when it hit 14 percent I got another heads up that there's around 300 miles left at this level it'll warn you every single time you turn off the vehicle or turn on the vehicle it'll show that again and you have to hit dismiss every single time so at the 300 mile range you're going to see this every time. So 13%, so the level hasn't changed. It hasn't gone down either. So maybe this will update when I go through a regen cycle. I have no idea when this truck goes through a regen cycle. It, there's no indicator on the dash or anything. It's pretty random. So I'll just keep tabs. So when it goes through another regen cycle hopefully it finally updates and my level should be at the 25 percent range since I only added a half gallon of DEF fluid okay DEF level is now at 12 percent still hasn't updated yet so I went to O'Reilly's I've been seeing a lot of O'Reilly ads on YouTube lately. So I'll support the company that advertises for you guys. This is my way of supporting the channels I like. So I went on I went to O'Reilly's to pick up a box of DEF fluid. I'm going to add the whole box. Maybe this doesn't like it when you add a half gallon, maybe it's not enough. So I'll add a whole box right now, see what happens. Okay, about to add all two and a half gallons of DEF right now. Hopefully that updates the DEF level on the computer. Okay, let's see if that updates the DEF level. It still hasn't. What the hell? Oh, there you go! But doesn't show the percentage until you're at 29%. Man, all that math for nothing. The stat nerd in me wanted to see this say 25%. I just I just like that stuff, but I guess if you add a little bit, it doesn't update the level. Adding the whole two and a half gallon jug updated the level properly. Start that up. Yeah, now it's okay. There you go. So, if you have one of these trucks, and uh, you put a gallon in, it might not update. I saw that in the forums. When I was reading about this in the forum, some people only put in a gallon and the uh, level doesn't update. Well, there you go. 
you have to add a decent amount, like a box worth, to update your level. Alright everyone, that's your little DEF guide. A little troubleshooting there. I was like, why the hell isn't this updating? Well, you have to add two and a half gallons for it to read the, to uh, update the little computer. I wish it showed the percentage all the time. I just like that stuff. It just says okay. Okay, I really want to do some math. I just like knowing things. So here we go. 5.5 gallons, that's 100%. We got down to 12%, that's 0.66 gallons. I added 0.5, so that was uh, 1.16 gallons. When I added that 0.5, nothing happened. It, uh, the percentage didn't change. So then I added the 2.5 gallon box. And then now the level says OK. That's 3.66 gallons. So I have half a gallon left in here. And there's another 2.5. So if I add that half gallon, I'm up to 4.16. So I need to add 1.34 to get to 5.5 so I could add the remaining fluid in here and then I'm gonna have to measure this out and let's see if we can get to 5.5 I think the computer will always read okay I don't think it ever says full it just says okay but let's see what happens when I get to full capacity okay I put that remaining half gallon in. I don't know if you could tell on camera, but you could see pretty deep into the filler neck. So I'm going to try to get it to where I could start seeing liquid. I'm going to try to get close. Okay, this is the 2.5 gallon DEF jug. So up to the liquid, this is about 6.4 inches. So I just divided it by 2, that's 3.2 inches, and this is 1.25 gallons right here. So I'm going to pour it pour it up to here, that's uh, 1.25, so that's going to be pretty close to 1.3. And this is a symmetrical bottle, so this is right at half, close to half. It's pretty close, not super 100% scientific, but pretty good. Okay, I don't know if you could tell, but I'm right at the fill spout. A little dripped out onto this paper towel here, but right there, when I saw that line, when I was getting close to that line, I was pouring slowly, and it's right there, right at the edge. So this is completely topped off. Okay, so that 12% was a little off. If the capacity is 5.5 .5 gallons, then that 12% was off. It was more like 7%. So see, I went a good 25% uh, under that line. So when your reading is about 10%, maybe a little under 10%, go ahead and add two of these two 2.5 gallon DEF jugs and you'll top it off because I was at 12%. So yeah, I was a little off. I was supposed to be around here somewhere, but it was a decent amount under. All right, so that's your DEF guide. I really wanted to see how accurate the percentage was, and there we go, figured it out. It's a little off. 12% is more like 8%, 7%. All right, everyone kick ass, be safe, take it easy, have a great weekend. Okay, one more thing to check before I wrap this video up. When I added that first 2.5 gallons in to finally get the computer to update, when I turned the vehicle on it briefly flashed 40% DEF fluid and 2002 mile range. So now that we know we're topped off, let's see if we get any additional information
nah, it just says OK. That's it. So even full, it just says OK. But now we know we have 5.5 gallons in there. All right, that wraps up this video.